Focus has now remained on ways to amend hunger and food shortage crisis facing the masses as food subsidization remains one of the ways to increase access to food and reducing hunger in the country. With the key drivers of the deteriorating food security situation in Nigeria set to include rising inflation, insecurity and high fuel prices, Nigerians are canvassing holistic approach to food insecurity and hunger ravaging the country. We should not lose hope. Nigeria is a favored land. And with the help and the prayer of the saints, Nigeria will get better. This phase will soon pass away. To have discounted uh, stable food item to our members at 70% discount. This is very lovely. It's going to be a continuous uh, uh, process. That means in a month we are going to have a market for five days. So it's, it's going to be beneficial. Meanwhile, it is crucial for Nigeria to accelerate its adoption of renewable energy to mitigate climate change. This is according to the sponsor of Nigeria's Climate Change Act and former member of the House of Representatives, Sam Onuibu. He says renewable energy can provide the energy needed by the country to fully industrialize. He emphasized this during a series of interventions made during the 14th International Renewable Energy Agency Assembly in Abu Dhabi, United Arab Emirates. Reiterating that Nigeria has a huge energy market with about 90 million undeserved people, the former lawyer said that government has gone ahead to create the enabling environment for the flourishing of investment in renewable energy in order to address the huge deficit in line with the renewed hope agenda of President Bola Tinubu.